beautiful South Carolina for this matchup here at William Bryce Stadium near Lake Murray. And we couldn't have asked for better weather for today's game between the Missouri Tigers and the Gamecocks of South Carolina. And here come the Gamecocks. Everybody, this is Brad Nessler. With me, as always, Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit. And we're set to bring you another great matchup in the world of NCAA football. The Gamecocks are much too powerful to be stopped in this game. Kirk, what are your thoughts? Uh, there's no question about it. This one's going to be pretty ugly. Missouri has spent all week trying to figure out how they're going to slow this running back down. Well, Lee, in my opinion, they could have spent all year. It still won't matter. He's going to have a big day and a big win. You're 100% correct. South Carolina is going to come in here and pound the ball right at this defense. And when they're done with that, Kirk, they're going to pound them and pound them and pound them even more. Thanks, guys. Should be an exciting game. Now let's get down to midfield where they're ready for the coin toss. Missouri has the ball teed up, and we're ready for kickoff. He kicks it. Williamson takes from the 10. They'll start this drive at the 21. The Tigers line up at a 3-4. Jenkins back to pass. Fires across the middle. Incomplete. Underthrown intended for the wideout. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 21. Number four is the deep back as they line up in the eye. They run a counter. He spins around. Simpson with a takedown at the 23. Two-yard pickup. It's third down and eight to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. The Gamecocks come out in a shotgun. Jenkins drops back. He's looking. Let's it go. Complete. He's out to the 40. Jones brings him down at the 34. And they get the first down. That is unbelievable. Wow, Kirk, this quarterback's showing some big-time nerves out there. Third and long, it's just like first and 10 to this guy. Yeah, you're right. A lot of poise from this young man. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 34. South Carolina comes out with an eye formation. He drops back. Let's it fly. And this one's going to get intercepted. Can't wrap him up. Sanderson with a takedown at the 34-yard line. And just a great interception by the cornerback. Well, that's big time. He made a great read on the quarterback and got in there for the pick. First and ten, ball on the 34-yard line. Farmer with three wide receivers. Farmer on play action. He unloads it, and it's intercepted on an amazing diving catch. The linebacker comes down with the INT. Let me say one thing, that was a tough catch. Even for a receiver, that would have been a tough catch to make. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 28. The game cop. Set up in the gun. Steps up in the pocket. Williamson makes the catch. And he got stopped before he even got started on that thing. That defense had to rise on that kid the entire time. Whoa.
Second and eight coming up here. Ball on their own 30. Missouri lines up with five defensive backs. Doyle brings him down at the 35. Five yards. It's third down and three to go. Ball on the 35-yard line. The Tigers put four men up front. They hand it off. Breaks one. Right with a takedown at the 42. And that was a nice run on third down. That's right, Brad. Those big uglies up front did a nice job of paving the way for the ball carrier. It's first and ten, fifth play of this drive coming up. The Gamecocks come out showing three wide. Jenkins back to throw, throws it out there. And it's caught. We knew these receivers were fast and athletic and they are not disappointing us. I think these guys are the difference makers in the game. I would expect to see the deep routes to keep coming and coming at this defense. First and ten. Sixth play of this drive coming up. Defense lines up. Eight men in the box. Robinson gets it on the inside. And they got him for a loss. He didn't get much on that play at all. Brad, the defense had that play read and sealed it off from the get-go. It's second down and 11 to go. This is the seventh play of this drive. Missouri comes out in a 4-3. Handoff up the middle. Ellison brings him down at the 18. A pickup of four on the play. It's third down and seven to go. Eighth play of this drive coming up. Number four, lines up in the deep back, eye formation. Set. Hunt. Hunt. Jenkins gives it up the middle. Mosling with a takedown at the 13. And he didn't get enough for the first. Now, Brad, he's going to come up short here. The defense does a nice job of not allowing the ball carrier to get out into the open. Now it's fourth down and two yards to go. Ball on the 13-yard line. They're crowding the line. Set. Hunt. Hunt. Number 20 gets the carry. He hit and got away. Kinney brings him down at the two. And so the drive continues. Let's see if they can take this one in for six. Set. Cut. They'll run the option. And he's in there. Touchdown. So the quarterback takes it in for the score. Yeah, nice job here by the quarterback to call his own number and get the ball in the end zone. And he tacks on the extra point. Less than two to go in our first quarter of play. The score, South Carolina, seven. Missouri, nothing. South Carolina to kick this one off. We should have a return on this one. Whitney fields it in the end zone. Makes a move. They'll go to work at the 26-yard line. 4-3 defense. On the ground, up the 
the middle. And down he goes at the 30. The fullback gains about four yards there. Second and six, ball on the 30. They come out with four linebackers. Farmer drops to throw. Gain has it. They'll bring him down at the 38-yard line. Not a bad play there. Not at all. And if this wideout can continue to make plays like this, allowing them to spread the ball around, this offense is going to be tough to stop. First and ten, ball on the 38. Abram lines up as a single back. Farmer back to pass, under pressure. Loses the football. Moore recovers a loose ball. And so the defense gets the turnover. Yep, the quarterback should have done a better job of holding on to the football. Now it cost him a turnover. It's first and ten. Ball on the 36. South Carolina comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. He passes it, batted away. Coach, he made a nice defensive play there. He sure did. He just stuck his hand out and hit the football. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. The Tigers line up in a 4-3. Here's a pitch left side. He's at the 30. Ferguson with a takedown at the 27-yard line. Gain of nine. It's third down and a yard for the first down. Ball on the 27. Missouri going with a three-man front. Handoff up the middle. And they make the stop at the 22. And that was a nice hard run there to get the first down. Yeah, I don't think there's anything more motivating than watching a guy work that hard for a first down like that. And we've come to the end of the first quarter with the score. South Carolina, seven. Missouri, nothing. Now the teams have switched sides and we're ready for the start of the second quarter. First and ten, ball on the 22. The Gamecocks with a full house backfield. Little handoff. The 10, the 5, and he's in the end zone. Touchdown. I'm so impressed with this running back, Coach. Let me tell you, Kirk, he got the ball a couple of moves later. He's in there for a touchdown. What a play. And he hits the PAT. South Carolina ready to kick this one off. Whitney and James back ready to return. Here's the kick. James fields it in the end zone. They'll take over at the 20. Missouri lines up in a shotgun set. Back to pass. He's looking for his man. Swatted away. Nice job getting a hand on that one. Yeah, really good heads up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. Go. 
So it's second and ten. Ball on the 20. Defense lines up. Eight men in the box. And they hit him in the backfield. He didn't really have a chance on that play. Boy, guys, how about the defense on this play? They sniffed that play out from the start. Third and 11 coming up here. Ball on the 19. Abram alone in the backfield. Back to pass. Looks. Fires a bullet over the middle. And it's knocked away. Well, the defense did all there. Well, the defense did what they had to do to get three and out and now get the offense back on the field. It's fourth down and 11 yards to go. Ball on their own 19. Harvey to put this one away. Jackson signals for a fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 48. They'll get the ball here at the 48. South Carolina comes out in the shotgun. He drops back, looking. He lets it go. He stayed in bounds on that catch. Heck of a catch by the receiver. The quarterback threw the ball off target, but luckily he's got receivers like this guy. It's first and 10, ball on the 30. The game time. Line up with two tight ends. He spins. And he's taken down at the 23-yard line. He takes the handoff and responds with a seven-yard gain. Second and three coming up. Ball on the 23. The Gamecocks go with the eye formation. Jenkins gives it up the middle. They throw a flag. And he's tackled at the 13. Holding, Holding on the offense. On the offense. Ten yard Ten penalty. penalty. Still Still down. Second down. down. Second and 13 coming up here. Ball on the 33-yard line. Missouri comes out in a 4-3. Cut! 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 Handoff up the middle. Doyle brings him down at the 25-yard line. About eight yards there. Third and five. Ball on the 25. Ball on the 25-yard line. They use four linebackers. Hot. 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 Number four on a pitch to the left. King with a takedown at the 17-yard line. And that is going to be enough for the first. Is this kid amazing or what, Kirk? Well, absolutely, Lee. You and I talked about him earlier in the game. What impressed me there is he knew exactly where he needed to go to get the first down the whole time. It's first and ten. They're threatening inside the 20. They line up in an eye. Here's an option right side. He's inside the 10. Touchdown, Gamecocks. Guys, that's his second score this half. This guy really loves the end zone. Yeah, he's having a nice first half of football. If he keeps it up in the next half, this team should be in good shape. Let's look at that run again. Nice job up front by the offensive line. Watch the offensive line hold on to their blocks, creating a nice big lane for the back to run through. Set. 
And he tacks on the extra point. Over three minutes remain in the second quarter, and the score is South Carolina, 21, Missouri, nothing. South Carolina to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. Whitney fields it in the end zone. They'll start this drive at the 25-yard line. The Gamecocks put four men up front. Farmer fakes a handoff. And they couldn't hook up on that one. The wide receiver couldn't catch up to that ball. And you know what? No one could have caught up to that one. He just misfired it. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 25-yard line. Farmer comes to the line with three wide. We're hot. We're hot. Farmer drops back to pass. He throws it. Complete. Muhammad brings him down at the 36-yard line. A decent gain on the pass. Yo, Kirk, good job by the quarterback here reading this play. Yeah, the defense came with a blitz, and you're right. Great job by this young quarterback of recognizing the coverage and spotting the open man. It's first and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. The Tigers line up with three wide. And it's caught. And they push him out at the 45-yard line. The tight end with a nice catch there. Second and one coming up here. Ball on their own 45. They use four linebackers. Farmer gives it up the middle. Brought down at the 48. About seven yards on that carry. First and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. The defense will stack the line of scrimmage. Abram hangs on to it, and he's taken down at the 47-yard line. They didn't get much on that pass. You know, this defense is too quick for plays like that to work. you got to mix them up a little. Second and nine coming up here. Sixth play of this drive coming up. South Carolina lines up defensively in a 4-3, and they make the stop at the 43. They got four yards on that one. It's third down and five to go. Ball on the 43-yard line. Defense lines up in a 3-4. Let's it go, and it falls incomplete. Good pressure that time as they brought the blitz. It's fourth down now, five yards to go. Ball on the 43. The Tigers line up to punt. Jackson calls for the fair catch. They'll go to work at the 14-yard line. They come out of the bone here. Jenkins on the option right, and he's going to lose yards on this one. South Carolina takes a timeout, and they've got two remaining.
Second and 13, ball on their own 11. South Carolina comes out with an eye formation. A handoff. And he's tackled at the 12. Missouri calls a timeout, and they'll have two remaining. Third down and 12. Ball on the 12. The Gamecocks line up in a goal line formation. Jenkins gives it up the middle, spins up field. The defense calls a timeout, and they'll have one timeout left. It's fourth down and 10 yards to go. Ball on the 14. Dean back to punt. James fields it to 48. What I like about this is the guys stayed in their lanes and didn't allow the big play. They'll take over at the 46-yard line. Trips right. Farmer drops back, steps up, lets it fly. Complete number 36 with a takedown at the 43-yard line. Let's see how the defense handles the no huddle. Drops back to pass. He's under pressure. It falls incomplete. They're down in seven, ball on the 43. Abram lines up as a single back. Farmer drops to throw. There's a flag on the play. He unloads it. Abram with a catch. They'll bring him down at the 38. Holding, Holding. on the offense. On the offense. The penalty is the play. Now it's fourth down and two yards to go. Ball on the 38. They use four linebackers. Farmer still has it. He steps up, rifles it over the middle, and it's caught. Thomas brings him down at the 25. And they get a few yards on that little reception. Check it out. He ran a good route on his play. And the timing of the pass was good. And they were able to get a nice game. And Kirk, that was a nice grab there. You know, it may be simple, but whenever you can gain solid yardage, you're doing something right. The Tigers are going to take a timeout. And that was their third and final timeout. Second and four coming up here. Ball on the 19-yard line. Number 91 lines up for the field goal. It's up. And he got it. Missouri to kick. Williamson and number 83 set to return. Not a real deep kick, should be returned. Williamson takes it at the eight. Nice spin move. Folks, let's pause now as we've reached the end of the first half. Our score at halftime, South Carolina 21, Missouri three.
South Carolina will be kicking off to start the second half. Kicks it off. James passes at the five. He tries to spin. They'll get the ball here at the 25-yard line. South Carolina brings in the nickel here. Quinn with a takedown at the 34. A gain of nine yards on the play. Second and one coming up here. Ball on the 34-yard line. South Carolina lines up defensively in a 4-3. Farmer gives it up the middle. Brought down at the 37. And they keep it on the ground for the first down. Nothing too fancy here. The key is that the running back was able to convert the first down. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 37. Farmer lines up in the shotgun. They hand it off. Spin move. Number 28 brings him down at the 39. Two-yard pickup. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 39-yard line. South Carolina comes out in a 3-4. Farmer gives it up the middle. Number 36 with a takedown at the 43. The halfback runs for four yards. Third and four. Ball on the 43. Defense lines up in a 3-4. Farmer gives it up the middle. Tackle at the 44. The fullback rumbles ahead for about a yard. Fourth and three coming up. Ball on their own 44. It's fourth down now, and we'll see the punt team. Jackson signals for a fair catch. He hauls it in at the 13. First and ten, ball on the 13-yard line. South Carolina comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Back to pass. Here comes the pressure. Throws it out there. Complete. Kinney brings him down at the 35-yard line. And a nice pick up there. I'll tell you what, the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz. And a quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man. It's first and ten, ball on their own 35. Missouri lines up defensively in a 3-4. Doyle with a takedown at the 48. And that one goes for a big, big first down. You know, every time you run the ball successfully like that, the defense starts to creep up a little bit. That's when you go to the air, my friend. First and 10, ball right around midfield. Missouri brings in the nickel here. Hot. Hot, hot. Hot. Jenkins back to throw. He's looking. Steps up in the pocket. Doyle knocks it away. 
Good awareness defensively that time by the linebacker. Not only that, but as you saw, he also made a very athletic move to get to the ball. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball right around midfield. They come out with a big set. He drops back. Steps up. Guns it across the middle. And he dropped it. He couldn't hang on to that one, guys. Well, I can't blame him for dropping that one. Did you see how hard that ball was thrown? Wow. Third and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. The defense lines up with six DBs. Jenkins, back to pass, looks, he steps up, Simpson brings him down at the 45-yard line. They try to play a little power football there. Yeah, but they got outpowered. Fourth and seven, ball on the 45. Looks like they're going to punt it away here. James calls for the fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 12. They'll start this drive at the 12-yard line. One man backfield. Farmer steps back to pass. He passes it. Number 45 tips it away. And that was a good defensive play. Yeah, guys, this is because he's in great position to make the play. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 12. South Carolina lines up with five defensive backs. Farmer drops back, looking, rifles this one out to the left. Incomplete pass. It's third down and 10. Ball on the 12. South Carolina lines up in a dime defense here. Farmer drops back to pass. Fires across the middle. And it's picked off. The defense now has two interceptions in the ball game. And that's two more than the quarterback wanted to throw. Now he's got to go back out there and play smarter football when the offense takes the field again. You're right, Coach. The quarterback has to be able to put that out of his mind and act like it never happened. Which one? First or second interception? I say both. It's first and ten. We'll see what they can do in the red zone. The Tigers use a four-man front here. Drops back to pass. He's looking for his man, and it's caught. Hey, what a great catch. Yeah, he was aware of where the sideline was and made sure he stayed in bounds when he caught the ball. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 13-yard line. The Gamecocks line up in an I formation. Jenkins, hands off right side. How about that stop? I uh, hear the linebacker uses his speed to come up with a huge stop behind the line of scrimmage. Third and 12 coming up on this one. Ball on the 15-yard line. The Tigers bring in the nickel package. Jenkins, back to throw. He's in trouble. Complete. Only three yards there on the throw. Fourth down and nine. Ball on the 12. 
They're going to go for the easy three here. The kick is up. And it's right down the middle. South Carolina to kick this one off. We should have a return on this one. Whitney takes it from the six. They had nothing going for him on that kick return. Oh, you're right, my friend. And that's because of excellent kickoff coverage. They'll go to work at the 18. South Carolina going with a three-man front. Little handoff. Number 60 with a takedown at the 23-yard line. A five-yard gain. It's second down and five to go. Ball in the 23. They line up in a double tight set. He's out to the 30. Thomas brings him down at the 33-yard line. And he busts a big one on this defense. The way this halfback is running the ball, I'd put a few more guys in the box there defensively to try to stop him. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 33. Abram alone in the backfield. Back to pass. He fires left side. Caught out of bounds and incomplete. Great effort here by the wideout, but you know what? The quarterback was off just enough to cause that incompletion. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 33. The Gamecocks line up in a 3-4. Farmer back to pass. Throws a lob pass out to the right, and it's caught. Number 45 with a takedown at the 33-yard line. So that brings us to the end of the quarter, and at the end of three, our score, South Carolina, 24, Missouri, three. And we're ready to start quarter number four. Third down and 10 coming up, ball on the 33. Abram lines up as a single back. Third and 15 coming up, ball on their own 28. He drops back. He lets it go. They lost a lot of yards there. It's fourth down and a long ways to go. Ball on the 17. They line up to punt this one away. Jackson signals for a fair catch. He hauls it in at the 41-yard line. They'll take over at the 41. The Gamecocks go with the I formation. Little handoff. And they make the stop at the 44-yard line. They get three yards on the play. Second and seven coming up here. Ball on their own 44. 
Defense lines up in a 3-4. Drops back to pass. He's looking. And they got him. He couldn't avoid the sack there, Coach. Hey, that protection has got to get better because you don't want your quarterback to get smacked like that. Third down, 13. Ball on the 38-yard line. South Carolina in a five-wide set. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Complete. To the 40. Kinney brings him down at the 37-yard line. And they convert the third down with a long pass play. You're right, Brad, and that was a long pass play. As a coach, you got to appreciate it when your players come out and perform like these kids are doing right now. First and 10, ball on the 37-yard line. South Carolina lines up in a shotgun set. Set! Hut! Hut hut! Hut hut! hut. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. And he lost a bunch on that one. The offensive line couldn't get a push against the defense. And the running back had nowhere to go. Second down, and they got 15 for the first down. Fifth play of this drive coming up. Missouri lines up defensively in a 3-4. Jenkins gives it up the middle. They'll bring him down at the 37-yard line. A five-yard pickup for the tailback. Third down and 10 coming up. This is the sixth play of this drive. The Tigers bring in the nickel package. He drops back. He throws it, and it's incomplete. He's short that time. No question. He had him open, but just couldn't manage to get the ball up enough to allow his wide receiver to get his hands on it. Fourth down and 10. Ball on the 37-yard line. They line up to punt this one away. James calls for the fair catch, and it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. They'll get the ball here at the 20. The Tigers, with four receivers, drop back to pass. Robinson bats it down. The corner almost came up with a big turnover there. Well, the corner's able to bat this ball away, but he'd love another opportunity there to make the catch. They're not going to like to hear me say this, but that's one of the reasons why they're on defense and not playing offense. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 20. The Gamecocks put four men up front. Farmer drops the throw. Under heavy pressure. Incomplete. Almost a nice catch. This is a missed opportunity here. The receiver got his hands on the ball, but couldn't quite pull it in. Let's check out the replay. Third and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. The Tigers line up with three wide. Back to pass. Looks. Let's it go. And it's knocked away. Great defensive effort that time. Did you see how that safety played that ball? That was a beautiful play. Fourth down and ten. Ball on their own 20. The Gamecocks bring in the nickel package. Farmer drops back, lets it fly, swatted away, and they're going to have to give the ball back after going for it on fourth and long. Not much you can do there. you got to go for it and give yourselves a chance.
excellent field position to start the drive. The Gamecocks come out in the wishbone. Handoff up the middle. And down he goes at the 12. Eight yards on the pickup. The second down and two to go. Ball on the 12-yard line. South Carolina comes out with an eye formation. They hand it off. Brought down at the 11-yard line. Pickup of less than a yard on the play. Third and one, ball on the 11-yard line. The Gamecocks go with the I formation. Number four gets it on a pitch, sheds that one. He spins around, tackle at the 10-yard line. Missouri takes a timeout, and they've got two remaining. Weaver lined up for the field goal. This should be a chip shot. It's up. And it splits the uprights. South Carolina lines up for the kickoff. James and Whitney back deep to return. He sends this one deep. James fields it in the end zone. It's first and 10, ball on the 20. The Tigers line up with three wide. He drops back. He unloads it. Number 87 makes a catch. And they got him for a loss. And they back up three yards on that play. Drops back to pass. He rifles it to the left. And it's caught. And he's tackled at the 23-yard line. They'll get six yards. I like what the coach is doing here with this hurry-up offense. Watch for this young defense to get a little confused on this play. Throws it out there. Number 11 with a takedown at the 33-yard line. Wow, how about that third down conversion? Boy, what a play here, guys. I'm really impressed with the poise of this young quarterback. He was very cool and collected out there on that third and long play. Number 28 knocks it away. And he's lucky that wasn't picked off. Second and ten, fifth play of this drive coming up. Farmer is back in the gun. Farmer drops back to pass. He guns it to the left. Robinson brings him down at the 47. How about that reception, Lee? A good throw plus a nice catch and some good blocking equals to a chunk of yards. That's exactly what you practice all the time, Brad. And he's taken down at the 31-yard line. Here's another look, Coach. Yo, check out this pass. That kid sees an open man right there and just zips it to him. Good pass. Nice catch, too. Farmer back to throw. And he dropped it. It's second down and 10 to go. This is the eighth play of this drive. South Carolina going with a three-man front. Back to pass. He passes it. 
And they couldn't hook up on that one. I think he was feeling a lot of pressure there, guys. Ha! <laughs> I'll tell you what. He's lucky he got rid of that ball when he did, because they were coming. Third and ten. This is the ninth play of this drive. South Carolina brings in the nickel here. He drops back. Under pressure. He's looking for his man. Number 93. Has it. Missouri calls a timeout. And now they've only got one remaining. First and ten. Tenth play of this drive coming up. They line up with trips to the right. Drops back to pass. Looking. Going deep. Robinson tips it away. Nearly intercepted that time. On that last play, you see the defense do a good job of playing coverage, and the quarterback telegraphed his pass the whole way. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 16-yard line. Abram alone in the backfield. Back to pass. He lets it go, and he can't hang on to it. Third down and ten coming up. Twelfth play of this drive coming up. The Gamecocks line up with six defensive backs. Farmer steps back to pass. He's under pressure. Gives a little pump fake. He's scrambling. And he just gets rid of it. Man, he had to get rid of that ball in a hurry. You know, it seems like he's allowing the defense right now to control him by throwing bad passes under pressure. What he needs to do is make some plays and start controlling the defense instead. Fourth down and 10. Ball on the 16. South Carolina lines up with five defensive backs. He drops back. Here comes the pressure. Fires a bullet over the middle. Tackle at the six. Not much of a chance on that one. Well, they had to go for it. They're at a point where there's not much time left, and you got to put it all on the line. They'll start this drive at the six-yard line. South Carolina will line up in a jumbo set here. Jenkins gives it up the middle, and down he goes at the six. No gain. So it's second and ten. Ball on the six-yard line. Number four lines up in the deep back. I formation. Number 20 on the handoff. Ellison with a takedown at the 15. And that's the end of the game. Kirk, any final thoughts here? Well, no doubt about it. This was a pretty big mismatch. Missouri actually played a good ball game today. They just didn't have the horses to match their counterpart. They need to start recruiting to build this program back up. And we thank you kindly for taking part in NCAA Football 2003. Our final score in this game, South Carolina 27, Missouri 3. For Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreet, I'm Brad Nessler with our final goodbye. We'll catch you next time.